Now, I'm already starting to wonder if I should maybe change class. I mean, if a lot of the game, well, the DLC bit of the game here is going to take place in these small, tunnel-y kind of areas, a mage with a decent tornado spell is going to wreak absolute havoc down here. Yeah, it also allowed me to get rid of some of this incredibly heavy gear as well, which seems to be weighing me down. Seriously, my walking speed really is a walk. It's supposed to be like at least a light jog, but I've got so much crap on me that literally I can only manage to walk, unless I'm sprinting. I'm sure you manage those three screams, either barely able to walk or sprinting. Ah, lunch. Excellent. I was feeling a bit peckish. Not for any of this crap, though. I should wonder if I, any of this counts towards some of the little bonus side quest things you can do back in the main game. I had hoped to this lead this life by a held in your measure. strong arms. Farewell. Okay. That was weird. This guy's taken a lot of amateur dramatics classes. I have a feeling I'm going to get there to give me a small stage in the middle of a cafe in the bowels of this place. I've been there going, ah, oh, what is this? A dagger I see. Dagger. Pass me the dagger. Dagger. Is there a dagger I see before me? That kind of crap. No idea what these guys are casting at. I'll leave them do it though. Oh, hello. Would be you then. Ow! Not to my face. The idea is that I hit you in the face, like so. Jesus Christ, wench. Perhaps I should change over to an archer. She's kicking ass. I and mean, she's technically a lower level than me. Ha. Huh. Right, okay. Do you open that from the reverse? It's a skill they don't teach you in many other games. Where the fuck am I going? Uh, I should be taking this threat a bit more seriously. Oh, hello there. No, it's a gargoyle. Does look a bit like what's-his-face. Old boon from the television. He was quite ugly as well, but no. No one over the age, well, over no, under the age, rather, about 26 is going to get that joke. Especially not if they don't live in England. Now, yeah, well. I do love the battle theme for this area. The heavy guitars and shit. Pretty cool. So, it sounds oldie worldy, but at the same time, obviously, being used, uh, being made, rather, with uh, modern instruments. Why well, do I spend a lot of time talking about the soundscape in these games? Don't worry about asking you there in the future watching this as you are. But if you do know, feel free to leave a comment, etc, etc. Speaking of which, excuse me, go go boy, ain't got time for your shit. Places to go, things to explore. See the mage used to punch viciously in the face. And by punch I mean bash through the skull with my giant sword. But I can swing my sword. It's not made of diamond, I know, but it's still pretty damn impressive. The kind of thing that would give Cloud an inferiority complex. Surprise! Surprise, motherfucker! Wow, my attack is literally doing nothing to you. I'm not doing any damage to this guy, what the fuck? I mean, I know that gargoyles were resistant to uh, physical damage in the main game. I'm pretty sure you didn't have to use magic to kill them. Huh, I wonder if that's a new addition for this lot. If so, one more point in the tally of me switching over to being a mage again. Or a sorcerer. Actually, probably sorcerer. I've got a mage in the party, so I don't need to be able to heal myself. Yeah, I kind of noticed. I've already face-planted, what, at least once so far? Probably gonna happen more than once from now on. Interesting. There's a lot of these corpses lying around with glowing items by them. I, mean, I know I sort of joked earlier on that Capcom were taking a page out of From Software's book, but you're taking it a bit too far. <laughs> hmm. What garden of strange delights is this? Not sure, mate. Certainly not the botanical gardens. Even in deepest, darkest Birmingham, they don't look this bad. Of endless diversion. Really, you have been taking a few amateur dramatic classes, haven't you, mate? You should tone it down a bit. Get a girlfriend! Stop sitting in the bottom of dank caves and... Yeah, really, dude. Tone it down, eh? I mean, Jesus Christ, Capital aren't renowned for their writing, but fucking Jesus, what's that? It's a just excellent! Oh, and there's a big dude in front of it. Don't attack it, you pillock! What the fuck would you think? Oh, look! A giant monstrosity chained to the wall! I think I'll go poke it in the foot. 
God, I've, I've met Watercress with more common sense. I really have. It's like Amble casually out the door. From my incredibly low walking speed. It's a loan screen I probably should have cut out. But fuck it, I'm already talking over it. I talked about saving the game earlier, so... Fuck it. Let's just amalgamate the two things together, shall we? Well, we'll do end of that conversation. Wow. Difficult business is speaking with the words and the sentence and the strings of syntax that actually make sense, isn't it? Hold on. I'm really not used to this anymore, am I? I've seen you games where you run out of stamina and you just sort of stop doing whatever you were doing. I forgot you have a recovery period in Dragon's Dogma. It's there to make you avoid running out of stamina in the first place. There's a lot of this game that requires a lot of micromanagement. In fact, why is my stamina bar going down as quickly as it is? I'm sure it shouldn't be. Ah, right, of course. Last time I played this, I put the thing on hard mode, didn't I? That would be why, yes. It would also be why all my armour seems to be weighing up to do crap done all of a sudden. I should be able to wear all this while only being light, well, moderately encumbered. Due to my levels and whatnot. You fuck off! How can you see I'm trying to take all- Damn it! Remember to destroy the oil pot, little prick. Just for that. Giant sword to the face. It is a bit like swatting a fly with a plasma cannon, but still. Kind of what? What's going on in my shadow? Completely detached from the rest of my body there. Is it still going on? Here it is. You see the shadow from my arm just swinging around on its own. What the fuck? Well, say with the arm or the pommel of my sword, one of the two. We encountered a glitch already? It would be a. Blessed relief. This rip is he actually going to heal me or is he just going to boot me straight into the selector pawn screen? Let's find out today. Nope, selector pawn screen it is. Well, I really don't need to be here right now. So, I'm going to feck off this way. It's all the same with you guys. And I'm going to regret this. I really should be taking more pawns with me. I mean, I've got a basic, well, a semi, a high level, but essentially basic mage healer. And my high level ranger, archer, whatever the fuck she is. I can't remember the strider, that's the name of it. Of course, because someone had a hard on for Aragorn when they're making this. I forgot. But yeah. I'm going to bother cutting out the loading because I'm going to carry on talking. But yeah, I really should uh, try and tailor my party a bit better. I'm definitely going to have to switch myself back over to being a sorcerer at some point. I get a feeling that's just going to be more useful in general. Other than that, though, I think pretty much okay. Maybe I'll have to bring in a warrior to replace my character, maybe. A heavy damage dealer kind of deal. Basically, your tank class. I should have had one when I first left, but uh, she fell into the ocean and died. Which filled me with tremendous confidence for the usefulness of my pawns. Actually, wait a sec. I can get rid of some weight by uncursing those items, can't I? Yeah. Alright, cool. Back in a sec. All my shit. All the shit belong to me. I found scrolls and jewels of antilite. What the fuck is a jewel of antilite? And I found completely useless anti gamma. My god. Well, that's nice. Oh, cool. I unlocked a new skill. The school. The school? The skill of opportunism. Interesting. You have to have a little play around with us, find out what all my new skills are. You know, to be precise. Hmm. Use basic stats. Nice. Right, well I play around with this lot. Um quick, got something else. It's all so quiet. It's all so still. The moonlight lends this place. My pawn is breaking the flow of my song and outright stating the mood I was going for. Ooh, a door. Where could this lead? Only to more adventure. Well, sort of. Most likely it's more horror and tragedy and things trying to molest me in the dark. I feel like a night out in Bournemouth, actually. Hmm. Surprise, spider! 
suddenly, girl with a giant sword from the sky. Fucking god damn it. She's got whole range tip boxes for different height things. It does work against me every now and again. I've been stricken. I'll heal all our wounded. You will? You don't have any healing skills. How exactly are you gonna manage that, Kira Love? I don't think I ever trained you as a mage. In fact, yeah, I'm pretty damn certain I've never have. So how exactly are you going to manage that? Those will be your feet. Let's put it that way. Uh, where the feck am I going? Around here, maybe? Goodies. Many wonder if I'm splendid for goodies. Yeah, that'll do. I think I really should stock up, shouldn't I? This DLC stuff seems to... Oh, fuck. Like, sh clearly should be a pathway. I'm offended by this door. Offended, I say. But yes, um, this DLC stuff really seems to like the status effects. In fact, oh, bugger. Oh, but I've just thought. Considering how much of a hard on this little add on segment has for status effects, I can think of at least one boss creature that loves status effects. Oh, please let me be wrong. They were relatively scant in the main game. Please don't let them be here now. Uh -huh. In case you're wondering what they are, I'll give you a clue. They look almost indistinguishable from a normal person while wearing a pork pie hat and dark sunglasses. <laughs> yeah, I referenced my own playthrough. Figure it out. Where the fuck am I going? Goodies, mine. So much collecting shit in this game. Grab everything, it might eventually be useful. Possibly not, but probably so. Uh, everything good in here. You guys have a point in being in here. Oh, hello, hello, hello. I see you there, Heidi Ho. I've been taught to look upwards about other video games. A lift stone. But again, I really should look into what they actually do. I kept meaning to, but never actually got around to reading the item description yet. You think after playing certain other games, I'd be uh, well up on doing? Really? I've got to impress you managed to do that just by walking. That takes a rare kind of a talent or stupidity. Yeah, well, as I say, I have met coffee grounds with a higher sense of self-preservation. Hmm. Okay. So it turns out that was in fact the wrong way, and I just walked in a giant circle. We are now back where we should be. Voila. The Vault of Defiled Truth. Bum bum bum! It's meaningless. The lot of it is mad. You're getting better, I gotta admit. Practice makes perfect. Just work on your projecting! Uh, kind of pretty. In a demonic and evil sort of a way. A lot more corpses lying around than I recall there being in the main game as well. Look, oh, fuck, no, nope. keep running, keep running. Don't know what they are, don't care to either. I can go no further. Then just stay wherever you are. Let me come to you and survive an awesome fall. I'm getting shades of Tomb of the Giants here, guys. Just saying. Fine. Yeah, just stay where you are. I'll come to you and twat you in the. F I mean, help you. Yes, help you. Get rid of your face. Uh, this way. I've got a good feeling. Crap. Well, there were treasure chests. That's something at least, right? Okay, we're in a giant hub room. So presumably going at least one of these ways should lead to awesomeness. Uh, goodies? Yeah. It's okay, I guess. Goblin? Or goblin? Hello? Um, hi. Couldn't figure out how to get through the door, eh? God damn it! See, I do love using great swords in this sort of a game, but they are so fecking slow. If I was using, you know, a standard fighter class or something else, I probably could have hit that guy at least once before he ran off. Better yet, if I was using a mage, I could have twatted him against the floor, ceiling, walls, and well, his own backside a couple of dozen times. Broken him in two with arcane ice. Well, probably not ice. Ice is useless. We know this. But I could have done something, damn it. You got the floaty... Balls of Doom spell. That's something at least. Doesn't really do much. I think it takes like hit of damage in your stead and 
occasionally deals damage to the enemy. Yeah, it's been far too long since I did this, I can't remember. What is this? No, it's the winter's term, isn't it? Why don't I even bother? It's barely gonna do any damage to anyone. I'm not sure what you are, so until I've got a better handle on it. My diving attack did almost no damage to you. Which means either you've got a very high defense or very high health. Neither of which bodes well for me. Surprise, motherfucker! Really, that's doing nothing! That wasn't one of my spells, was it? To the face! And again, you didn't even flinch! Motherfucker! Fine. I'm gonna charge up the Kamehameha of sword attacks. Takes about six years to finally charge, but... Oh, when I get there, buddy. Oh, I'm gonna give you such a whooping! Hit you so hard, your baby's gonna go bruised! Where is he? Don't walk away at a casual jog, I can't compete with that. Or oh, carrying my giant sword! Well, it's an instant kill to anything I hit. It's good to know, but... What the fuck was that? Oh, I got zapped. They've got mages. No, this isn't good. As Liam Neeson would say, if we're in 16 foot of their spells, we're already dead. Uh, take some of this shit off me. Heal yourself, bruh. Or not, just stand there trying to cast spells directly in the face of the enemy. Marvellous plan. I'm impressed, really. Impressed by your stupidity, that is. I'm also kind of impressed by those spellcasters. They can cast around corners. I've done that myself a couple of times. It's not easy. Especially not when you're using a spell that's only supposed to be lock on. Actually, no, you can't. You can, you can do, um... Every effect tracking versions of that, can't you? I forgot. Jesus fuck you. Guys, now you're taking the purse. Oh great, your dress is damp, eh? Yeah, that's the pertinent matter here. It's a nice dress and all, but still. There's more important things to Why is my mage charging face first into battle? When my archer is not. Well my archer's supposed to be ranged, but so is my mage, god damn it. You're not supposed to charge face first into battle either, Tofa. You're supposed to, you know, enable me to do stuff like this. Here, hold this for me, would you, lad? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I didn't kill you, though. God damn, perhaps I shouldn't have started the new stuff on hard mode. I should have switched back down to normal mode before trying to do this. If I switch back to normal now, it'll boot me back out to the normal game, though, won't it? It'll restart. That's what it did the last time I changed modes. Hmm... Oh, one quick save later. Did I steal their lunch, perhaps? Nope, not having a free lunch in this game, god damn it. Wait a minute. I've been here before, damn it. It's almost as if you copy pasted this entire room. But switched. Yeah, you switched that wall with that door. I am technically speaking lower down than I was. I think. But I still have to go lower if I'm actually going to get to where the game is trying to tell me to go. So. Yeah, this way. Ow. It's kind of annoying you can't change the direction of your jump when you land. Hold on. That doesn't make sense. You've got to carry the momentum in the direction you were going. But it'd be nice if you could sort of land and roll sli at least slightly left or right from your original trajectory. That'd be useful, you know. Uh, speaking of which, what the fuck? I can hear flapping. Flapping is never good. A arisen. Be wary. Yeah, I'm more concerned with the flapping noises I can hear. Look there. I oh, fuck. Okay, that's exactly what I didn't want. How you go, man, I call that though, right? Enemy that uses status effects? This DLC's massive hard on for status ailments? Jesus Christ. Impressive, you can put your wing through the wall. Yep. At least you can't come into this corridor with me, but... Oh, please don't believe you just stood right in the paralyzing gas. Please, please don't tell me you didn't do that. Ah, uh, well, this should be a pretty statue. Is that right? That should comfort me in the all the five seconds I have left to live. My main pawn is basically just managed to kill herself. 
Awesome. I forgot what a pain in the ass it is to fight cockatrices. Oh, God. Getting indigestion now as well. Oh, God. Okay. No, I feel better. I'm fine. I'm fine. I should have bought a bunch of crap before I went back in to do this, though. I went straight past the weird ass peddler dude with amazing scarf. I didn't buy anything off him. Probably should have come to think of it. Like, and perhaps not, because everyone seems to want rift crystals for some reason around here rather than gold. You get your priorities straight, man. Summoning pawns, well, proving to be not that useful, let's put it that way. Well, you two try and at least take out some of the hobgoblins for me. I'm never going to be able to take down this cockatrice with a dozen and one horned gits swarming me. Fuck, no, no, don't walk into that. That would be bad. Turning to stone is a great way to ruin your day. It's put quite a crimp in your lifestyle. Unless you, you know, never really did much anyway. In which case, you're fine. Yeah, I'm fucking grand. I think I've been hit with slow. Yeah, I have as well. My movement speed's down to like 10% of normal. Do I have anything that would cure slow? Um, I don't think I do. That man's still draining at a regular rate, despite my slower movement speed, though. So I probably should figure out... Uh, cure, maybe? Nope, that doesn't cure that. Well, that cures physical, doesn't it? There we go. Slow counts as a physical debilitation. Excellent. Time to twat it with a bit more efficiency. What are the odds of pausing exactly there? I'm half tempted to take a screenshot. But again, this is a video, so there's no need, really. So, well, at least my day's going better than hers. There's always that, right? Well, I didn't realise the your know, bad breath status thing could affect the enemies as well as me. Wish I'd known that earlier. Could try to lure them in front of it. Get rid of a couple of them. It doesn't make sense. It counts as an environmental hazard more so than a personal hazard. There we go. Roast turkey, anyone? That did, like, nothing. If that thing's got higher magic resistance than the mainland versions, well, you've just got crappy spellcasting abilities. Which, considering you are basically a mage rather than a sorcerer, would make sense. A tragic, tragic kind of a sense. Right, that takes care of you three. That give me at least a little bit of room to breathe here. You know, relatively speaking. Nope, because they're on fire. And they're still trying to kill me. Really, guys? Really? Priorities, man. Stop, drop, and roll. Then go after the cute girl with the giant sword. Uh, okay. Physician, heal thyself for some such bollocks. Don't do it while standing in front of the fecking cockatrice. Retard. Uh, what else do I need to give him? Actually, no, fuck it, he can stay as he is for now. I'm just gonna charge up a bit of this, try and get round behind it, smack it in the ass with my giant sword. Didn't do anywhere near as much damage as I'd like. Seriously, I've got the highest attack power of any of my character models so far. Oh, character- Ow! Peck me, you freak. Or it didn't poison me, at least. That's something to be grateful for. Actually, it's the peck or the claw attack that causes poison. Or whichever. Still a massive pain in my ass. Speaking of which- Oh, right, of course I remember now. Hitting it in the- Right, okay. Let's see if I can get some decent damage on it. I need to at least knock this fucker over. No! Ah, nice try though. Ooh, like a pro. Dodging like a ninja. I was zigging, I was zagging, I was so fast. He says as he walks casually around. Ah, fuck. I've been hit with slow again, haven't I? Yes, I have. Though, you know, I can hardly tell. So there's always that, right? Right, right. Uh, get rid of that. No, stop doing that. Push the wrong button. Ow, fucking Jesus. I accidentally heal myself to fall and then get twatted back down to the health I was already at. What are the odds of that? Pretty high knowing my luck, actually. Right, um... Yeah, I need to get him on the ground and preferably on his ass as well. It's the head and the glowy waddle thing that's the weak point for this enemy. He causes a lot more damage if you hit them. Than... Really? Really, dude? You're gonna get stuck game poison now as well, losing all of your health. 
Like, did I give that to you or just use it myself by accident? I'm wasting my panaceas on you by any chance. Ah ha ha ha, this could be going a lot better than it is. Okay, I got this. I got this, you guys. Don't worry. This cockatrice ass is mine. Just as soon as I figure out how to actually knock it out of the sky. Uh, okay, we're gonna regroup and rethink this. Come on, Topher. This way, buddy boy. I need to get you out of there, heal you up. Uh, I need to get you out, heal you up. Get you out, heal you up. Dude. Stop playing with the bird. Get your ass this way. Listen to your master. Thank you. So whoever programmed you didn't do a very good job, did they? They set you up for a lot of independent thinking. No, this way. When I say follow me, I mean follow. No, this way. Fuck's sake. Get your setup as long as there's an enemy around. You keep trying to twat it. Uh, we need a strategy though, a plan, a course of action. Exactly, all that could be happening. Um. I like this plan. This plan seems to be working. Damn it! Ah, there we go. Finally, we're working on the same page, mate. It'd be a lot better if you start casting lightning a lot earlier on. That would have helped me tremendously, matey boy. Yeah, smacking it in the face and the waddle seems to be causing quite a bit of damage. If I could guarantee to stay on the ground long enough to use it, Arca Deliverance will probably end this fight pretty quickly. As it is, I don't want to be slowed down by Arca Deliverance's ready animation. I guess I need to dodge out the way quickly or something. One crash, crash. Yes, your ass is mine, boy! Giant sword, giant sword, I swing a giant sword. Walk softly and twat it. I think it's the basic idea. Yes. Cockatrist, crocka don't. Cocka shite. What's this? Okay. That went swimmingly, I think we'll find. Or you'll f oh, whatever. With the words and the things. I win, I win, I win again. Ah, oh, fucking Jesus. Suppose I best start writing a letter to Elmo. Let him know the big bird isn't coming home today. <laughs> okay, uh Decisions and things. What an intentionally badass pose there. Um Hmm. Should I stop here? Should I push on a little further? Hmm. Mm. Mm. No, fuck it. I spent like, what, 20 minutes walking back and forth between the main area and here when I was uh, finding stuff to be purified or whatever it is. Decursed. So, if you factor that into how long I've been recording so far, that should. Mm, even then, it's going to be tight. Yeah, like I say, bollocks to it. Um. Just push on a bit, carry on exploring. I can get as far as the next sort of main chamber kind of things, like these gardens and those big underground places, they seem to be like the main hubs. I can get as far as the next one of those, I'll call it a day there, and that'll be that. Uh, so I'll make a decision in the next episode as well whether or not I actually change class or. The fuck is that? Oh fuck! No! Da 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 da! Da da da! I don't expect any danger at the moment. Right, sudden traps. That's new. At least within, you know, dungeon areas anyway. I come from out in the open world, that's the first time a dungeon has done that to me. Surprise, motherfucker! The surprise being I leapt at you with no stamina of which to attack when I actually got there. Brilliant job, me! Thankfully he's too busy trying to twat Topher in the face. Ah, you let me get my breath back. A bad decision on your behalf. Surprise! My character actually hit you. No there we go. I certainly hope that we defeated a cockatrice. If a single hobgoblin could take us down. I mean, what would that say? Just what would that say? Uh, anything good up here? Hmm. I hear grunting. Grunting is never good. 
I mean, not in this context anyway. Can we find elsewhere? Guten Tag, Harry Monsters. Harry Scary Monsters. Hello. Ah, crap. Ogres. Though I, I should have a pretty decent setup for this. I, it is ogres that are resistant to magic but not physical, right? Or is it the other way around? If it's the other way around, I could be boned. Which is why I'm going to save my game. Because I'm a coward. But I'm not dumb. So. This game will ever stop saving. That's the one thing you guys need to work on. If you do do another Dragon's Dogma Capcom. You know, because obviously they've watched this. Ah, shit. Great, so one completely new enemy I've never encountered before suddenly attacks me. The exact same moment, a very dangerous one I am familiar with suddenly spots me. Crap. Crap, this could be going better. Fuck off. Fuck off. Really, fuck off. One at a time, please. Please. Ooh, bit almost fell over. Smacking in the ass. Or not. My incredibly slow attack speed. I think I did almost nothing to it there. Nah, piss off, piss off! You're supposed to be on fire and shit, get off! Well, this is going swimmingly. Alright, now I'm going for a ride! Get off, get off, I am not a doll, damn it! Fuck, fucking get off me, you freak! To the face! Oh no, not now, not now. Come on, come on, come on! There you go. And see you again, excellent. Fuck you! It's an ancient martial art, not very many practitioners, but I am somewhat of a master. So I say somewhat again. Uh, fuck you! God damn it! I swear my timing used to be better. Pissing! Fuck it! Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Take that! In the shin! Why isn't that staggering you? I'm sure the multiple attacks to the leg are supposed to cause this guy to stagger. Am I just not doing it right, or am I thinking of the Cyclops instead? Oh, a terrible feeling, I might be thinking of the wrong enemy type. It just means my sound stuttering as well. Probably shouldn't be trying to figure this out in the middle of heated combat, but... What the fuck, right? Let's start being smart here. Take advantage of the terrain. Now, as long as he can't climb like the Chimeras can, I should be fine. Nope, he's far too stupid. Excellent. Now they'll just give me about half a decade to charge this attack. I might even survive this battle. Anyway. Here he goes. Uh, surprise, motherfucker! He jumped straight into my attack as well. What a dumbass. Right, charge it up again. Oh, I'm very aware, I assure you. I'm so aware, I'm over there. Yeah. Yo, dickhead. So to attack the lady first, I'm over here. Oh good, you've killed my only remaining pawn. Now any time you'd like to attack me would be immensely helpful. Except no, you're just gonna fuck off over there. Okay. Apparently lost interest. Guess Dave needs to work on his charms. I couldn't walk off the ledge while that attack's powered, can I? Fuck. Get up, you dumbass. You're embarrassing yourself. And me, more importantly. Right, okay. Let's charge this up. No, don't get its attention before I finish powering the attack, you prick. Oh, well done. Really, I'm impressed with you. Really? No, not fucking really, obviously. Okay, yeah, if I can get it to come over here without killing me. Fuck, you idiot! You knocked it out its run animation by setting it on fire. I lost all that effort of charging up the attack. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Ah, I missed me, asshole. Watching that attack to the back swing. I got at least some of you. Sort of. Again, it's becoming a lot easier. My pawn to work with me rather than against me. You know, we had a thing going on when we were fighting the cockatrice. You sort of at least vaguely understood what I wanted you to do, and. Oh, fuck, you can climb! Charge, charge, charge before he jumps again. Fuck, no. That didn't work. Run! And I'm out of stamina as well. Surely my stamina should have been going up while I was charging that. I wasn't actually doing anything. No, whatever, right? Dude, I need to stock up on stuff again. I'm using up far, far too much here. Surprise, motherfucker! 
Well, I missed entirely. And somehow I activated the grab ledge animation. Interesting. Hmm, so you were weak to magic. What do you know? I'm sure those were a lot easier to fight in the vanilla game. Right. Okay, I think I've pushed my luck far enough for one day. I'm gonna uh, stop things here. Comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye now.